Watch where you're going! Now, now, settle down, my darling honeys. Hi there, my little cool beauty. Are you hurt? Well, Master Zellos himself has deigned to speak to this girl, and yet look how she acts! Just look at her. It's not even festival time, and yet she's dressed up in an angel costume. How stupid are you? Can you believe the nerve of this hag? What did you say? Genus, let it go. She's obviously never looked in a mirror. What did you say? You're all behaving like children. Now, now, settle down. Are you upset, my little angel? You know, I bet you're as cute as a button when you smile. Whoa! Wow, that was a surprise. You sure are strong, my little angel. You certainly startled me. Well, who are you? No offense, but I'm not interested in talking to guys. I hate this guy already. Ooh, what's your name, beautiful? Give me your name and I'll give you mine. You copied Lloyd! Uh, now that I've heard someone else say it, it sounds kind of arrogant. Oh, my, you don't know me? Well, well, I guess I still have a ways to go. <laughs> Master Zellos, let's go! Oh, yes, yes, of course. Well then, I'll see you again, my lovely lady, my cute little angel, and, uh, you other people. What was that all about? What an ass! He was grinning like an idiot the entire time! What's wrong with that guy? He had an X-sphere on him. What? No way! So that's how he reacted so fast. Just who is that guy?
Well then, I'll let you get to work. The sacred wood goes to Altamira. You can do it after your current job is done. Understood. The plan is right on schedule. I must report to Lord Rodial. Hey! Hang on a sec! Um... Persea! Could we have a moment of your time? I'm Lloyd. This is Colette and Rain and... I I'm Genus! Hey, Genus, why are you all flushed? Would you let us help you carry the sacred wood? W wait I'm sorry, I know this is a bit strange, but please hear us out. The truth is, we have a letter we wish to give to the king. Our friend's life depends on it, but we have a problem because the king is sick and refuses to see anyone. It would really help us out if we could carry it for you. Uh, are you listening? Understood. Um, Persea? Please carry that. Oh, okay. Leave it to us. Oh my... Wait... Wait a minute. Ah, this thing is heavy. I've lost all confidence as a man. Me too. Anyway, let's follow her.
Yo, Lloyd, you're finally here. Uh, Zelos, right? Yep, yep. I'm the great Zelos Wilder, but you can just call me Zelos. We're gonna be traveling together for a while, so uh, let's be friends, okay? He sounds like he doesn't take anything seriously. Let's see, putting aside the two guys, this gorgeous beauty is Rain, right? And then this cool cutie here would be Colette. And then who's this little one? Persea. She helped us sneak into the castle. The little one isn't from Silveront? Ozette. Ozette? That village out in the boonda? I mean, out in the forest? Ah, that's so sad. You're being used by these uncivilized barbarians. Who are you calling uncivilized barbarians? Hey, 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 don't get mad. Especially after all the trouble I went through to contact the Imperial Research Academy for you. Not bad, Zelos. I know. Using the Research Academy requires permission from the King. But when the Great Zelos speaks, His Majesty listens. Since you're going to be keeping tabs on us, I'd certainly expect that much. You're an obnoxious brat, you know that? Going to the Imperial Research Academy is fine. But can we have you free Prisea? Surely you don't need to keep tabs on her as well. No. The Imperial Research Academy and Ozette are both on the continent across the sea. So we can just drop her off when we go. I agree. That's a great idea. Is that okay with you, Prisea? Yes. Okay, then. Where should we go? To Cybac. It's on the other side of the Grand Teteala Bridge. It's northeast of here. The Imperial Research Academy. I'm getting excited just thinking about it. Let's go, everybody.
They're trying to cut us off! Come on! We'll have to jump it! Whoa! whoa wait! Time out! Are you nuts? We'll die if we fall from here! And if we abandon them, they'll die too! Let us continue our pursuit. Ma'am! due to an unknown force. No damage detected. Phew, I thought I was gonna die. Thanks, Sheena. I'm sure glad I was able to summon her. Excuse me, but Professor Sage and Genus are... That's right, we have to save them! Damn, they must have escaped! Give us back our friends! Silence! This is going to be a piece. Okay, there. <laughs> 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 That was just warming up. Lloyd! Everyone! You came to rescue us. Of course. You're our friends. But we're half-elves. So what's your point? Lloyd! What about the Tethayala half of our group? Do you mind if we join up with you? I'm from Mizuho. We're not exactly mainstream either. We're not that different. To tell you the truth, I can't say I'm really kosher with this. Then again, people have always treated me differently, saying that I'm a descendant of angels. So in a way, we're a lot alike. I just want to go home. I see. All right then. By the way, why is Sheena here? I have orders from my chief. I'm supposed to observe your activities. That's typical of Mizuho. They're trying to decide if they should side with the king or you guys. So now we have two people keeping tabs on us. But I'm not trying to do anything or get in your way or anything, so... so... We know that already. You're an honest person, perhaps to a fault. At this point, I'm okay with anything. Now we just need Sheena to form a pact with Volt, and we can get those Riards working. Volt? Sheena? Nothing. Then shouldn't we go get the Riards first? Either way, Volt's temple is on the other side of the Grand Tetheala Bridge. It'll be faster if we pick up the Riards, since the bridge is closed off right now. Pick up? How are you planning on moving those things? <laughs> just leave that to me. I prepared a secret weapon just in case something like this happened. What secret weapon? It wouldn't be any fun if I spoiled the surprise. Now let's get going! To the Fuji Mountains! I can't believe we're going to have to climb that mountain again. Hey, Zelos, how are we going to carry these? Oh, I'll show you. Come over here for a sec. You've walked right into my trap, fools. He just called you a fool. Zelos is clumsy. Ah. <sighs> I'm so sad now. You, retrieve the Riards. Yes, sir. This time you're mine, Lloyd. Damn! <gasps> oh, Lord Ewan, what brings you to this place? I think I've seen that lady somewhere before. I should ask you the same, Pronima. The role of your designs is to wreak havoc upon the declining world. I have come here on Lord Yggdrasil's order to retrieve Colette.
please turn her over to me. Fine. But in exchange for handing over the Chosen, I'm taking custody of Lloyd. I trust you have no objections. I've received no orders in regards to him, so please do as you wish, my lord. Colette, don't go! <laughs> a futile effort. Your words cannot reach a Chosen who has lost her soul. What is this? Why is there such a crude key quest upon the Crucius Crystal? How pathetic. I shall remove this ugly thing at once. No! This is a birthday present that Lloyd gave me! Colette spoke! Colette, are you back to normal? What? Why is everyone inside that thing? Impossible. There's no way that pitiful key crest could restrain the Crucius Crystal. Wow. Not bad, Lloyd. How could this happen? Still, in the end, it is but a worthless bauble. It shan't last long. Now, come with me. Let me go! Whoops. Oh, oh no! I broke it! All right, good job, my little Colette. I think I'm falling in love. <laughs> now that's our Colette. Some things never change. That brought back some painful memories. Colette! Lloyd! Lloyd, thank you for the present. I was so happy. I was really happy. But there wasn't anything I could do at the time. It's okay, don't worry about it. Behind you! You impudent! Prepare to die! You will pay for making a fool of me! Take this! There. Dark Spear! Demon Fang! Photon! So that's the weakness! Honey! that enemy's weakness. Oh man, you're making me study here too? This is the perfect opportunity. Ewan, I'm going to settle our score right now. Kratos! What are you doing here? Leave, Ewan. Lord Yggdrasil has summoned you. Yeah. Are you taking the Chosen? No. We shall leave her for now. It's the Toxicosis. I see. Lloyd, our battle will have to wait. He's an angel too? Damn it, Ewan! Wait! What are you doing? 
What? Why have you come all the way here to Tefe'ala? I'm here to save Colette. What good will saving the Chosen do? The relation of the two worlds vying for each other's mana will not change. Their positions have merely been reversed by the regeneration ritual. Has Tefe'ala begun to decline? The Tower of Salvation can still be seen from this world as well. As long as that exists here, it means that this world is still flourishing. Although in the event that the Chosen becomes Martel's vessel, Tefeala will surely bid farewell to its era of prosperity. Damn it. Isn't there anything that can be done? Yggdrasil's the one that built this twisted world. Lord Yggdrasil does not consider it twisted. If you want to do something about it, use your own head. I thought you weren't going to make any more mistakes. Yeah, I'll do it. This stupid system of two worlds stealing mana from each other. I swear I'll change it. <laughs> well, do your best. I remember. That Pronema was the one on the projector at the Asgard Ranch. That means she's a Dizayan. Now that Kratos came to interfere and all, it looks like the Dizayans and Crucius are really the same organization. It would appear that Ewan is connected to Crucius as well. This is all so confusing. In other words, they're all our enemies, right? Yes. That means we must be careful of everyone, including the Renegades. Colette, is everything else back to normal? Besides your voice, can you feel things and such? Yep. I think I'm okay. Thanks, everyone. And I'm sorry I made all of you worry so much. Hey, you know what? I think I'm hungry for the first time in a long while. That's great! It looks like I still have wings, though. Oh. Hmm. Just like I thought. Colette is definitely cuter when she smiles. Let's see. You're... Celos? Oh! You remembered my name! We chosen have to stick together, you know what I mean? Okay. Now what shall we do? Since Colette has regained her soul, there's no need for us to head immediately back to Silveront, but... We know what we have to do. We're going to search for a way to save both worlds in order to prevent any more Chosen like Colette. I agree with Lloyd. I promise Sheena, too. Colette. What about Prisea? It's not fair to keep dragging her around like this. I want to go home. Oh yeah, that's right. We need to bring Prisea to that Kate chick. Unfortunately, I doubt we can use the Grand Tetheola Bridge anymore. Hmm. I have contacts in Maltokyo. Let's ask them for help. But we're wanted traitors. Can we even get into Maltokyo? Leave that to me. I know Mel Tokyo like the back of my hand. All right, we're counting on you, Zelos. You got it. You can always count on me. Now, my honeys, we're off to Mel Tokyo. Colette? What's wrong, Lloyd? Welcome back. <laughs> I'm glad to be back. <laughs> <laughs> 